for having me here. And uh, I want to apologize for the lateness. But uh, I had a really great time with Nishad, who was the winner. Uh, I was super excited. I would think I was more excited than she was. <laughs> oh, we were both excited at the same time. Um, it's fantastic that you guys have done something like this. I wish I would have entered so you could come to my bedroom. But we had a great time discussing, discussing sorry, colors and uh, prints and all sorts of other things we would like in the dream bedroom. And everyone knows our bedrooms are very important. This is where we need peace and relaxation and where we rejuvenate after a hard day of work, right? Yeah. So we want to make it special. And I think Portigo, uh has given a lovely young girl a chance to create a dream room. And they have the items that created a fantastic room. I was very jealous, by the way, just to let you know. So if you want to come to my room, my doors are open. <laughs> Instead of your typical uh, bedside uh, drawers, I uh, had found some elephants, elephant tables, like carved elephants, and I bought two for each side from, oh gosh, where did we go, Fiona? Jodhpur. Yeah, so I something like that. Uh, then I also had picked up this little table set as well, and then some wall hanging. So yeah, you pick up different things when you travel. Designers also tend to sort of evolve, uh, you know, so we'll have a lot of the younger generation designers coming in. Uh, so as and when uh, we find that they match with our uh, brand philosophy and our uh, brand positioning, uh, we would certainly uh, tie up with them. When decorating my home, what I take into consideration is, oh, I would say color first, um, in my house at the moment, I chose different colors for different rooms uh, due to the fact that color has a, an effect on your emotions. So I chose the right color for, say, my living room, which was a yellow, because I needed to always be bright and cheery and make me happy. So when I walk into my house, it's just full of yellow, so it always makes me really happy. My room is like a very sensual mauve color, you know? <laughs> so it's, it's a very sensual bedroom. So also the bathroom, you know, the bathroom is a, is a salmon color, easygoing, neutral color. So yeah, color is really important for me. And then I would look at uh, my bedding, the fabrics, or my throw pillows and, and those fabrics, and the prints, and I'd work that way. I, I haven't, well, you know, as we're traveling and we're on the airplanes and stuff, there'll be uh, some lifestyle magazines that I've seen something in and maybe I've taken a picture of it as well. And I also get on the internet quite often just to look at different styles. Uh, so I haven't picked up any particular magazine. But you know, you'll come across things. Even when you look at, uh, just say, fashion and clothes, you know, sometimes you might see something like this, and you're like, oh wow, I'd love to have sheets this color. It would brighten up you know, my room, or throw pillows like this. So I think you can find inspiration from everywhere. Well, when you say brand conscious, you know that every brand uh, has a different style. So like Portico New York has these amazing designers that they brought on board. So I've seen some of the stuff and I really like their stuff. So then you stay true to a particular brand for that reason. Mm -hmm.